Welcome back to the Paranormal Review, and today we have a picture called Moose Hunter Captures Possible Bigfoot on Trail Camera. Now, this picture is very interesting because they have a moose, and they have a Bigfoot-type creature. Well, look at the hair on this Bigfoot. It is bright white. Look at this moose. It is brown. Now, is it possible that this Bigfoot has lighter hair? Yes. Or that it's white? Yes. Um, is it a Yeti? Maybe. I don't know. But there's a few things that I find suspicious about this picture. I find it oddly suspicious that this moose is right in the exact spot. Sorry about that noise. I said update come through. Um, I find it oddly suspicious that this moose is in the exact same spot as this Sasquatch creature. Okay? Almost as if they were like, hey, look, look how big this moose looks. We can put it on the camera. Put the camera in the same place next to the same trees and show how big this moose is. I mean, this this uh, Bigfoot creature is. Um, there's one problem. We don't know how old this moose is. It could be a younger moose. It does appear to actually be younger. It doesn't have a full hairy coat. Um, we don't know... We don't know what it is or how big it is, so it's hard to compare and say, well, that Bigfoot is a monster huge um, Bigfoot. Now, the people, I believe, said that this moose, they estimated it weigh around 700 pounds, but, I mean, yes, it is possible, but just at the angle this moose is, you can't tell how large it really is or how tall it is. This tree here, I mean, if I had to say what, how tall this branch was, I would say that branch is only about six feet tall from here to the ground or less. I mean, it doesn't look that tall. Now let's go back to the actual Bigfoot photo. There's a couple of things wrong with it that you can't really tell in this picture because of how bright it is. I took it over here and I um, kind of did some a little bit of darkening of it. And when you darken it, you can kind of see there's a fold here like it's a costume. Also right here, kind of a little tuft that flops out. Also look at the hands, the hand here. Where are the hands for this creature? Also, if you look at the leg, follow the leg line up here. It meets and it ends abruptly right near the buttocks or gluteus maximuses. <laughs> and that tells me that this is probably some kind of a suit or a jacket, a fur jacket, and maybe some kind of a furry leg pant or suit pant, that, a furry Bigfoot suit or a Sasquatch or a Yeti suit that maybe is white with like a white fur jacket over the top because look at the leg. Normally, this would go up and then curve around and then go into, you know, into the back. This just goes straight up and then it ends kind of like a long jacket being worn over a suit. And then the hands, it looks like there's not really any hands there. It looks like black gloves or some kind of a hair, or it looks like there's not really anything there at all and the hands are just up in these sleeves. Okay. I'm going to say this one is definitely a hoax put up by someone who wanted us to think that this moose was huge, found a, great, a really good opportunity, um, and threw it up there and said, hey, look, this moose looks the same size as this Sasquatch. Let's, I mean, looks really big. Let's put a big old Sasquatch-looking type thing there. And it looks like either a suit or, a, or some kind of a, you know, a jacket with a hood. You can kind of see where like the hood doesn't stretch around the head so it has a little bit of a flab there anyways guys until next time please subscribe let me know what you think about this photograph as well as my other work um subscribe there's a little red button down there make sure you click that so you can get more updates frequently and until next time we'll talk to you later thanks a lot guys